Hi, lovely community. Hi, Esteban. So good to have you here. Hey. Hello, yes, wonderful. Thank you, lovely people, for joining for another Medicinal Dreams Restorative Yoga. Oh, life, wonderful, wonderful answer. Beautiful. So this um, whole week is about letting go. And uh, I, I thank you so much for carving out the time to look after yourself and join the class. And uh, Medicinal Dreams has generously offered to send out a swag bag, a goodie bag for anyone who, um, who joins the whole eight classes until the end of the month. So please leave a comment below on what are you grateful and thankful for today. So the classes will be Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 10 p.m., and Sunday at 4.30. Hi. I love this, Esteban's comment. Ah, so one, once we get started, please take a moment and get some pillows, something super comfy maybe a block or a big book or whatever you have available and just get creative make yourself feel as cozy and safe oh great i look forward to it oh thank you for um <laughs> letting me know you're there okay so with the subject of letting go i think it's um at least for me, it's very close to the heart. And uh, the last year has offered a variety of library to choose from a different issue that we might be dealing with. <laughs> Letting go of the background noise. And I'd like you to make this hour sort of like your own ceremony once you're already here, you might as well bring all of yourself here and light some candles, take a few drops of your favorite oil or get some gummies, put on some music, make it like a holy ceremony, meaningful for you. And together, let's release. And what, whatever you're going through, maybe it's grief or loss or fear, or loneliness, or overwhelm, or maybe a um, toxic relationship, or maybe an old thinking and belief pattern that does not serve you. You can even write it down on a piece of paper, and then at the end of the class, you can physically get rid of it, burn it, rip it, do whatever feels correct and oh hi whoever is joining now please leave a comment on what you are grateful for now what you are grateful for now what is working for you and for me personally this class I want to let go of the fear of being vulnerable and being um, weak at times and asking for help and um, I will let go of that with you so whatever feels like is no longer serving you let's devote this whole class to release 
And now let's come onto our backs. If you feel like you want to use some cushions here under your pillow, feel free to do so under your knees. <laughs> And you can have a soft gaze, have your eyes slightly open. Give your body a moment to fully arrive. Let go of all the things that have happened today. Start to let go of your thinking mind. Just softly gazing around you, maybe looking for a color or a texture. Something that is pleasing your eyes. Be focusing on the sounds around. And starting to become fully aware of your own physical body. How does the back of the head, back of the skull feel against your bed or against the floor? Maybe turn the head. How does the back of your upper back, your lower back feel against the mat? Can you feel the subtle shift with your inhale and your exhale. Become aware of your arms, your fingers. The backs of your legs. Sense everything starting to melt. Have gravity to be your friend, offering you support. Feel like you are being held. And you can start closing your eyes. And I'd like to invite you to see if you can tense all the muscles in your body. Tense your face, tense your fingers, make everything super, super, super stiff. And then let go, let everything melt. Just playing with the contrast, getting the full joy of being relaxed. One more time. Let's tense everything, clench your fingers, your wrists, your face, Urgh. everything, your toes, and then let everything melt down. Explore the feeling of calm. And then turning inwards. Asking yourself, what am I willing to let go of? What do I want to let go of?
for a moment investigate where that emotion, that stagnancy lives in the body. Do you feel like you are holding the emotions in your shoulders, on your hips, on your fingertips, your knees? Where does that emotion physically live? And then using your creative, creative mind to imagine the opposite feeling, life without the feeling, the thought pattern, the relationship, whatever it might be. Who am I without this emotion? We'll take 10 breaths together, just investigating what does that freedom feel like. Get specific. Breathing in that new version of you and breathing out with gratitude the lessons learned. Two more breaths. See if you can make the inhales even bigger, even more joyful. U2.1. Exhale, let it all out. One more time, big breath in. And exhale, bye-bye. Slowly on your own style and pace, start making your way up to seated. Take all the time you need. We'll come to a little forward fold. So you might be creative here. Use all the props, use all the pillows you have available. Maybe place some pillows under your knees. And then lengthening the spine. See if you can breathe, breathe, breathe. The chest open, the spine long, and then just fold forward. Take all the time you need to come into the pose and find the correct distance that works for your body. A place where you can find a sensation of stretching and releasing. And then just find stillness.
We'll stay here for about three minutes. So your only task is to stay fully present and respectful for your body. Staying present in this very moment. And with every exhale, allowing the gravity to have more of you. Let the face feel soft. Imagine the thing that you have let go of or are in the process of letting go of. Imagine it falling off to the ground. Physically feel it exiting. And cultivating the gratefulness of what it has given you. Feel your neck. Feel the back of your head and your jaw. Feel that calm melody of your own breathing. Indulging in the sensation of safety being supported. Whatever emotions might come up, just know that you are not alone. You are in a safe space and held space. And for a moment, see if you can imagine the community of us all breathing together, releasing the beauty of that all together. Deep breath in and exhale, letting go. Halfway through through the pro through the, the pose, is there anything you would like to change? Is there a way for you to go a little deeper?
The beauty of yin yoga is the invisible magic that is happening when you give yourself a permission to unwind. The body and the mind a permission to digest and rest. At this moment, you are in a state of healing. We'll stay here for five more breaths. Inhale, feeling the back of your body rise. And exhale, feel the chest softening your face. One last breath of surrender, let go. And at the end of the exhale, you can slowly start walking your hands back towards you. Take all the time you need, we are in no hurry, no rush. And gently remove the pillows from under your knees. And then building your little castle here on your side. So bring the pillows close to your hips. Now that we've stretched the back of our body, I want us to get a feeling of freedom on the sides. So Bring that castle as close to your hips as you can and then find your own way to fully fold forward here. Getting onto your side and take a moment to explore. Does it feel comfortable to bring your opposite arm over or have your left arm supported on the mat. Just spend some time to sink in, finding your edge. What you want to achieve is a sensation of freedom on your side. Sensing the chest. If you feel like you might want to intensify, you can also turn your chest towards the pillows and come on to a twist, maybe even turning your face towards the right side, whatever works for you.
having your eyes closed. Again, tune in to the inner knowledge. Tune in to the sensation of what does my body feel like without my fear. What does life look like without my fear? Feel your whole body being held halfway through, is there anything you'd like to change? Observe the sensation of calmness. restfulness. Ten more breaths. Feeling the body melting away. Feeling the worries melting away. Ten more breaths, sorry, five more breaths. And 
you can either have your eyes softly open or have them close as you gently start to climb all the way up like you're waking up from a long nap. And coming on to the center, having your knees bend, and maybe just gently rocking from side to side, noticing the changes. Two more times, side to side. And then pausing in the center and simply moving your pillows all the way to the other side. Bring the pillows close to your hips. and focusing on finding the stretch on your side body. Start melting over the pillows, over the blocks, and just explore what feels good in your body. Where do you find a comfortable edge? place of deep releasing stretch and then finding stillness. And for anyone tuning in a little later, please write a comment on what you are grateful for today so that you have the opportunity to get a wonderful Medicinal Dreams goodie bag. Breathing into the sensation of openness, of receiving the beauty of letting go. You are creating a space for something new, something fresh. And you are in control of what you want to fill that space with. Maybe some joy. Maybe self-respect. Boundaries. Love. You choose.
halfway through? Is there anything you'd like to change? The space between your eyebrows, feeling open and soft. Your whole being in a state of healing. Notice the belly moving with the breath. Notice the legs heavy and supported. The state of calmness. And safety ten last breaths here making the inhales just slightly longer the pause between and the exhale Slowly when you feel ready, gently starting to exit from the pose. Take all the time you need. Noticing the subtle changes, the realignment. And again, turning your knees towards the center. And just sweeping from side to side. You can pause in the center, maybe hugging the knees. Give yourself a hug, a thank you. And as we've now opened the back body, both of the sides, I want you to feel the openness of the chest. So bring your pillows just under your lower back. Take as many pillows as you want to build your own castle here. Bring knees, bring, <laughs> I want to confuse knees and pillows. Bring pillows under your knees. Do whatever works for your body to feel supported and held and safe.
the longer holds offer us a beautiful time to get out of the young state of mind of doing, of being active and achieving. But with every movement, bring in that softness, very caring attitude. And the attitude and the state of mind of softness. Whatever it is that you are releasing, just know that you have all the tools you need. Tuning back into the state of mind, of playing with the opposites, whatever it is you are ready to let go of, who am I without the feeling? What does life feel like without the feeling? How does my breath move without the fear? How does my body, my shoulders feel like? What can I offer for others without my fear? What can I offer myself without my fear. We'll stay here for another 10 breaths.
feeling the belly lift and lower. Noticing how heavy the body has become by the act of you letting go. Noticing the beauty of the openness of this chest, the symbol of receiving, being ready for the change. Being ready for something new. And tune in for a moment. Our next final pose, the Shavasana, the final resting pose. Ask your body what movements it needs to make. Do you want to stay here? Do you want to move one or two pillows from under your back? Maybe place one under your knee, under your hips, whatever feels most coziest. And when you feel that, find that space. Let everything melt towards the ground. You can have your palms facing up as a symbol of receiving. Or you can even place your hands on your heart as a symbol of self-respect of believing your own intuition. Believing that without this feeling, there is a window opening. Inhaling gratitude of the lessons learned and exhale. <sighs> Breathe out the old. Inhale new. Exhale old. sinking into your state of meditation, making your mind a beautiful landscape.
Have a beautiful night, everyone. Thank you so much for joining. You guys are awesome. Good night.